for those characters. Because also another big thing is Tweak is also known as one of the best ledge trappers in the game. Right. right? Did so in Smash 4 amongst Larry and Zero. Did it here in this game. ECM also with Pikachu because of the jolts was able to avoid ledge trapping yes. because that stopped, that prevented him to get those spacing. A lot of times we saw him get kills from that area. So yep. again, a lot of the two key things that we saw tweak those win conditions were non-existent. Yep. So it looks like coming up next, we've got DeBuzz against MVD. Meanwhile, on the other stream, we've got Void against Shuton. It's a game five over there. And this is just a hand warmer, so I'm watching that. Oh yeah, absolutely. You guys, you guys are fine. Yeah, you guys are absolutely fine. We got CLG Void versus on Wolf. Shuton. Game five. Void playing Wolf. We've swapped out for the Pichu. That's gone. Got a Let's Go Void chant in the crowd. Void can s Oh, he got us right. Yes, yes. Let's go. Let's go. Void defeats Shuton with Wolf. Game five, so close. Let's go, boy! Woo! And I think just in time, Woo! the match is coming back over here, MBD against the Buzz. Now I can tell you, for this matchup, Olimar used to terrorize Snake. It used to be so frustrating because Snake, all of the stuff that he was really good at, Olimar just kind of invalidated it. I want to see how that works in this game. The Buzz used to eat snakes alive. He famously had a pretty big money match, I think, with uh, with Razor way back in the day. Both those guys saying that their yes. characters won the matchup. The Buzz was like, no, and then he dumpstered him. Hell yeah, man. Hell yeah. No surprise we're not seeing the Polutena here. Yeah, oh my goodness. You're still just watching the boy. I, I, I mean, <laughs> dude, that's my boy, man. Yep. I see my man Korean popping off. I want to pop off with him, man. Look who else is walking up there. That's your boy K9. Oh, going yes. He's to be going up against Zachary. Yes. That's going to be a big one. But over here, let's start it off. MVD yes. against the Buzz. The tournament is popping off now. Let's go, boys. Let's go. Let's go. Woo. Starting off on Pokemon Stadium 2. Again, this was a matchup that Olimar really excelled in previously. Not sure how it works out in this matchup. We will have to see. But obviously, Olimar, a lot of people really comparing to his Brawl iteration. Right. And Snake, he, he's kind of the spirit of Brawl. He's right. Brawl incarnate. He really is. He really is. C4 on the ground there. Yep. And it blinks sometimes, but not others. That's weird. Yeah, so it usually blinks in the beginning, and then after a while, uh, it goes away. Is that what it is? Yes. Okay. So it's one of those things where it's you have to be aware because it's once you see the grab, yes, you. exactly. Yeah. It does a signal, so it's not too overbearing, and then afterwards it goes away. Oh, look at you. Yeah. Look at you doing this stuff. Good stuff. All right. Right now, 127% on MVD. Nikita is out, but I don't think that's going to be particularly good against Olimar just because he can put out an aerial so easily to stuff it. Yeah. Good catch there with these nades, man. Getting a tons of damage. Potentially getting a kill soon. Nice. I love it. Excellent bait from MVD to Buzz. Betting that he was going to fall into him there. MVD using his second jump, blowing up the C4, yeah. earning the first stock. Yeah. Incredible, man. Again. The Buzz firing back though, earning yep. his second stock. True. With the uh, calling out that jump. We got a two stock game here. Yeah, sometimes it can be hard just keeping, uh, you're looking at all these nades happening all the time. And of course, the mark of a great snake is they're going to have these nades being pulled out. And in between, they're going to put these down bees in, in a space that you are not even paying attention to them. Because yep. by the time those blinker, the, the flicker goes off, you forget where it was, you're too busy looking at these nades, and all of a sudden when you think you have him cornered, he strikes. Yep. Easy kill. Tries to call out the jump. Triple Oh, sleeping. okay. Yeah, I love that. We're going camping. That was the triple back. I don't know what that <laughs> yeah. was. I can't believe he got away with that, but. Good call out on the second jump from the buzz. You see so many Olimars doing that. That up air just covering so much space. Yeah. MVD also, wait. Does the Pikmin grab the grenade? Did you see that? It looked yeah, like it grabbed the, the grenade and started attacking it. Yeah. I've, I've never seen that. <laughs> that was so that was not in Brawl, I can yeah. tell you that. Oh, that's for sure. That's the only reference I have in this matchup, yeah. guys. Sorry. Good yeah, exactly. I feel like Nikita's a non-factor here. 
All of them are so well protected. True. Two purples and a white. We hey, saw this see, with the. Yeah, uh, you see them pulling it back. Yep. I <laughs> so saw that funny. with the uh, with the Myron setup. True. Good up smash from DeBuzz. Hundred fourteen right now. Again, two purples is the setup he wants. Getting that free twenty-eight damage. Eating the up smash, but it's not enough to kill. Oh gosh! Whoa, yeah. Oh, what a catch! Yeah, maneuvering the uh, Nikita in a perfect way. We were talking about recently signed tweaks, but MVD also recently signed a world's best gaming. True. Dubuz, if I'm not mistaken, sponsorless. Yeah. Yeah. Still sponsorless, man. Oh no, I'm sorry, Gravity. Oh, right, 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 right. Yeah, that was it. I see double up air coming out from the buzz on that. Okay, good dash attack. We try to run it back again. The buzz uh, into that beautiful reversal. And you saw the buzz charging that down smash. Big commitment. Didn't quite pay off for him. He had the right guess on the uh, get up from MVD, but yep. didn't have the punish. Yeah, that's weird. Like when the Pikmin grabs the grenade, I yeah. can't stop looking at it. Yeah, and it pulls it back, right? <laughs> Poor things. It's so funny, too, because they're like, look what I got. It's like bringing it back to it's all of It's like a Looney Tune. Yeah, yeah, right? <laughs> Next big hit should do it. The Buzz trying to call out the second jump again. Oh, a lot gosh, of rolling. Jesus. Yes, that good. roll is stale. Yep. Oh, yeah, God. you can't do that. Nope. Can't do that. Everybody ripping off the jacket after that first one. Looking oh, wow. All right. a little frustrated there. Okay. And he, he looked a little flustered. He I would definitely say. looked flustered. So I think this is going to be really scary because you know DeBuzz. DeBuzz always does his homework, he does his due diligence. Yeah. And one thing I've known from MVD MVD is really about that kind of set play and his traps, right? Yeah. But those are things that, as someone who studies players, those are the things that are kind of easiest to really research on because it's not so much the adaptation, it's about these strong walls that he's able to put up. Right. And once you recognize those, you find cracks and you go from there. Discussing a stage right now, I'm trying to get a read on what they're saying, but they've got to fill out these little player cards. I hate these things, by the way. I, I'm glad that we have them for the data, but like having to fill these out every time, it's a disaster. Yeah. <laughs> I get it, you know what I mean? Yeah, we yeah, need yeah. that, but. Buzz winning that first game. Have to see how this next one goes, see if MVD makes the right adjustments as we are going to PS2 again. No stage swap on this. How you doing, man? All right, one into the game, two here. And stomp in the yard, man. Rising up. Catch yeah. There's going to be an easy amount of damage for the Buzz. The down air from Snake, super good, but not necessarily in this matchup, just because you don't want to be hanging around all of our shield for too sure. long, as we saw yep. at the end of that last game. Absolutely. Yeah, good swing, man. Trying to get pin him out of the air. It's going to be really important as he tries to get him close to the other side of the stage so we can pin him down. Good forward tilt yes. there. Beautiful up tilt. You can see him avoiding the Nikita, or is he? Finally getting hit there at the end, wow. and I said I wasn't <laughs> sure if Nikita was going to do much for him, but MVD has now hit it three times. Oh, no, it, it's, it's a move. Regardless, it is a move. It's popping. Yeah. Purple is out. MVD setting up these traps, trying to force the buzz to come to him, and I can definitely see why he likes PS2. He likes having the C4 explosion on that platform exactly. to cover that base. Yeah, and it's so hard to see when you're, once you're just kind of standing normally, you're not going to see it on the side. Very easy to hide. Especially with the camera. Yep. Because like if the camera's on the left side of the stage or the C4 is on the right and you don't have that con constant, you know, reminder of where it is, it's very easy to lose yep. track. And of. that's one of the big things. Uh, there's certain characters that can really work with uh, kind of how the cam dynamic camera works in Smash and really make you kind of forget what's going on. As you can see, he actually went for the C4 stick onto himself. It is yep. right now on MVD. Yeah, it does swap and now, around. Yep. Who's got it? Did it fall? Oh, it's on MVD. Yeah, it's, yeah, on it's on his shin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, it's, it's hard to again. see. Yeah, it's on his shin. It can also fall off sometimes. Yes, it can. Got there him. we go. It's not, yeah. Oh, he stopped it. Wow. But again, he got out of that last hit yep. just because all of them are so tiny. Tiny alien space thing. Yep. <laughs> space astronaut, man. 
dead even between these guys again. Very evenly matched, it appears. Good forward smash, yeah. Hundred and eleven MPD retreating to the sky, getting hit by the up tilt. But I'm sorry, the up air, but it's not going to happen. Yep, I'm not. Oh, yeah, the catch! I love it. Yep, first hit him there in the up tilt. That and, is a very real thing. And there are so many things that we said, you know, like brawl, like brawl. That's not like brawl. No, Snake could never do that. Not at all. That is the ultimate exclusive. Yeah. Okay. Attacking his shield again, but. He was able to get the cross up on that. No punish on that side. Yeah, really nice stuff there. 171 on MVD. This is exactly what he wanted, just to live forever on this very yep. heavy and, champion. And now he can go ahead and really just kind of whittle him down with these nades, bit by bit, killing all these Pikmin until he gets low. And, wow, he went for it. Good damage. He down tilt. Hits him up. That's a setup. It's so scary to get around. Nairs through it. Excellent work by DeBuzz. Only has the one Pikmin, but it's the one he needed. Yep. Oh, gets yeah. Gets the grab on the blue and gets the kill. <laughs> boom, 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 boom. I love that move. That joint hurts. Yep. I just love how the screen shakes just to remind you you're actually getting stomped out. It's a grown-ass man. Yep. Grown man down move. Throw. And DeBuzz fighting his way back into it. That damage output from Olimar is no joke. 74, Good 95, there. just steadily racking up. But you can see the blue Pikmin diligently True. bringing back the grenade. Yep, That's not but what the buzz wanted. What a funny matchup thing. Like, if the Pikmin don't die to the grenade, they bring it back to you, and you're exactly. like, no, 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 no. Yeah, go back. <laughs> I don't want that. Yeah, it's actually pretty hilarious because essentially he can just lob the grenade in between the Pikmin and uh, Olimar. Oh, you're done. Yeah, see ya. Surprise. When did that happen? Yeah, think about it. <laughs> when did, when did he, that, you guys can see, when did that happen? I didn't, was I not paying attention? Like, that is the beauty. Am C4, I done? No, C4 is so crazy in this game because you have a couple of options, right? You have the fact that you can do the, the self-stick. Right when you uh, go fall off off the edge. Yeah. Also, even the fact of just going for a run up stick, it looks like a whiff to grab in this game, and I and I believe it comes out around. Uh, it's like frame. I it's think it's fast. around frame six or it's something fast. like that. It's really fast. So it it literally is something where you can see him just kind of do something and you hit him out of it, and you don't even realize that you got stuck. Exactly. Over on the other side, we got K9 against Zachary. Zachary up 2-0. K9 trying to fight his way back, but. Uh, it's looking pretty rough for him right now. It's three stocks each. Back to this game. Now 1-1 one, one between MVD and DeBuzz. DeBuzz, of course, going to Battlefield, one of his favorite stages. He likes to Good sit under these platforms, but MVD, as we saw before, likes platforms himself. True. And then sit back here, yep. You can set up shop, put the C4 out there. Give him some time to actually cook some grenades. Good catch there. Another one. I love this relentless pressure. Yes, goes for the grab. Ooh, running down smash. Ooh, yep. Gets the C4, though, 113. Yep, that was the play. He was not looking for a read there, ladies and gentlemen. Going for the down smash because if he did a regular getup, potentially could hit him doing anything. And, of course, if he rolls into the center stage, he had it covered with C4. Again, the traps here for MVD. That up tilt so strong. Forward tilt not going to be enough to kill just yet, but the Nikita is out. He's got to yep. find a way around it, and he can't. Gets the untechnical no, bounce. And that's the beauty, because the thing about it is, even though he can do Nair, even though he has those Pikmin, ultimately, in order to recover, Olimar is forced to let go of those Pikmin, and that's when MVD strikes. Yep. Oh, the tech chase. Yep. Stick. Looks like it, yeah, yeah, it, looks it like just landed on the platform. Just barely missed. But again, that's the kind of thing. Him just going for a jump there. It looks like he just went for an empty hop. No, that's a stick. 131% on MVD right now, who is sitting on the other side of the stage. Doesn't get the blue throw, so he can't kill off it, but the purple is... Oh, I thought the purple was up, but no, it's white, so he's not going to get any damage off it. Oh, that's oh, it. No. Yeah, you gave it up. Yeah, unfortunate. Looked like he was going for a uh, few burst instead. Had to have been. Okay, that's, so that C4 oh, wow. was actually super slick, because he did a drop through C4 to actually put that one down, and I don't think the buzz recognized it. Right. Good for Tilt to Buzz struggling to find a foothold to find Oh, yeah, and control. here we go. And the Nikita combo. Oh, yeah, we're coming, son. You can't me. 
Three! Homing missile. It is heat seeking. Yep. One of the strongest tools in Snake's arsenal. And the fact that it is zero risk. It is so good. It is so, so good. Wow, my man just said, I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> ran right up yep, to him. Yep, just ran up on him. Beautiful up smash out of shield from DeBuzz, recognizing the situation, taking it slower now, trying to find this kill before MVD can get damage racked up on him. Mm -hmm. He's got to watch these aerials too because he does not want to hit the grenades. That's why he's not going up there. True. Blue Pikmin, forward throw, not going to be enough to kill. The dash attack. Oh, I love that. Another dash attack, get him off the stage. Drop it to C4. No Nikita there. Oh, I love the parry. And DeBuzz looking pretty animated right now. You yep. guys can't see him, but we can see him kind of pushing forward and hunching. He wants this more than anyone. Oh, absolutely, man. And that, that'll do it. Yep, that's one. Both these guys, wow, a lot oh, of Oh, no, oh, they know. They know what's at stake. Yeah, these guys are animated right now, both of them wanting this game You do so not want to drop in the loser's bracket. It is filled with sharks right now. Is he spinny thing to up tilt? There we go. Shout out to the Fatal, wherever <laughs> he may be. <laughs> oh, my God. And, and look at the damage here from DeBuzz. That's the thing, dude. DeBuzz's uh, damage output on all. Okay, lots of rolling. Yep. DeBuzz's damage output on Olimar is unrivaled. Oh, man. Almost got that spike on that uh. dash. Yeah, going up. Set up. Pressure. Oh, the grenade. Was that the... Grenade, yeah. I don't know. Was that the Pikmin bringing it back? The fact that... I thought he walked away from it, but I guess not. So many intricacies. Oh, Whoa, the setup. Running around. They're going to parry that. C4 goes off. Tries to get the spike. Oh, not I love happen. that. Gets put yep. in a bad position. Okay, what are you going to do here? He's put in the a play, yep. bad spot. Put him in a box. 145, next big hit, we'll do it. Oh, he ran up with the purple, yeah. didn't see the grenade. So much pressure. Oh my goodness. Oh! Bombs away. Oh, the dash attack, oh here Nikita we go! Out, Nikita. Here we go, the mini game is being played. Oh yeah it is. He survives. Oh, wait a minute. It's great. That's oh, you're it. dead. That's you it. Dead. He's dead. I He's don't dead. care who you are. I don't care if you're an astronaut. No space for you. So for anybody that doesn't know, at 160%, the down throw up tilt is true. Shout outs to Gimmer, who dropped that knowledge. You know, that's actually uh, one of the, it's one of the info things. One of the tips they gave you in the game. Is it really? Yes. No way. Yes. It actually tells you that. Wait, it tells you that at a certain point, it's... It, it, it tells you that he gets more advantage. He can do more. That's dumb. Higher percent. Isn't that funny? That's a word for it, I guess. <laughs> That's funny is a good word for it. It's a great word for I it. I don't know, man. All right, so MVD, <laughs> MVD taking a quick break, taking a drink of water. Ooh, man. Over on the other side, looks like we got MK Leo against Leffa. Good God. Oh, man. We, go. we are here at G6, baby. We got ourselves some matches. These are... Excellent matches, you guys. Yo, yo, faded battle. Faded battle. Faded battle. It was meant to happen. Leffen looking like the strongest Pokemon trader on the planet oh, right yeah, now. He, yeah. <laughs> oh, he took him to PS2 also. Yep. Taking Ike to PS2. I thought it was a big no-no, but Leffen's kind of rocking him. I mean, I think, again, what does your character do, right? Oh, yeah. Yeah, Ivysaur definitely loves those platforms just the same. Guys, we, there's too much action happening. Uh, I don't know where to look, man. There's and we're supposed to be commentating everywhere. matches. This is ridiculous. Just an unreal uh, just concentration of Smash talent in this room. I the love this game, The best players man. in the world are here across so many games. Yep. I, I love this game. I love all you at home. I hope you guys are enjoying yourselves because... I definitely am. This is phenomenal. So phenomenal. Anyways, we're going to go in it. Game four, ladies and gentlemen, when we are on town and city. MVD caught off that amazing, amazing victory. He knows what it means. I wow. I think DeBuzz needed this. I think he needed the space. Because we saw on Battlefield, MVD just setting up so much pressure in that limited amount of area. And using the platform so well. That's usually where DeBuzz likes to go. But against Snake, I don't think he has that, that luxury. 
Yeah, man. I, you know what, dude? I love Snake so much, and I've been playing him. I'm going to start playing him a whole lot more, though. Yeah. He, he's, he's definitely one of my main characters, but, dude, the way that MVD is playing with this character, these traps are so clean. I don't know, though. Right now, the buzz firing back after that last game. True. Playing it a lot slower, only as the one Pikmin out. He's going to be able to get out of there. Okay, good swing. Yeah, MVD going a little desperate with these dash attacks here. Yeah, Trying to force the issue a little much. True. Okay, the Nikita, not gonna get it. Oh wow, good low profile with the crouch. Yeah, easy turnaround. The Brawl Classic. Yeah, he was ready for that. The roll yeah. in from DeBuzz, trying to pick the right option. But I can see why this stage is so good. Those platforms giving DeBuzz another option in terms of avoiding the exactly. Nikita. Exactly. Get, being able to recover safely. Yep. Oh man, what a catch. And DeBuzz going up, man. 2-1. Yeah, this is what can happen when DeBuzz gets you in his sights. He True. just kind of takes a break, feels it out, understands how the set is going, adapts, and that, comes alive. That's why I actually do not like that MVD went for a break. Because I feel that DeBuzz yeah. is someone who loves to study. He loves to pick. If he's able to sit there and look at his notes, you don't want to give this man time. I feel that, yeah. He's a Batman. <laughs> you do not want to give this guy preparation. Yep. Two stocks to one. The Buzz trying to find this way to snuff out MVD. Gets the down tilt, just free damage, nothing more. But has MVD at 102. But we've seen the way that both these guys can just rack up so much so quickly. The platform's going away at the Ooh. worst possible time, but the Buzz doesn't even need him. Wow. Yeah, air down look, smash. Yeah, trying to look for him to go for a directional air dodge. Did not happen, though. He just literally just swiped this man in the face. Boom. Oh, yeah, yeah, we're going to game five. What Buzz. a dominant performance. Like I said, I don't believe that delay, the break. that stall, that break was not a good play by MVD. The Buzz really putting on the iron gloves for that one. He's like, no, 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 no. Nope, yep. This is mine. He's like, you gave me too much time. Now we'll see if MVD utilizes the counter pick well. Looks like it's Unova. Yep. Not too surprised. It's very similar to PS2 which he's not allowed to go back to. Olimar's Snake again. Obviously, no character swaps from these two. Game five between MVD and DeBuzz. Let's see if MVD can bring it back. Here we go, guys. All right. Unova Pokemon game five. Lane. And this just seemed to seem that, it just seems to be the game five stage, man. Yeah, we saw it against Tweak and Esam earlier. These guys playing so slow. Now, it's funny, because like this set has really been the battle of the platforms. Now they each have their own. Yep. It's like they're both standing on exactly. opposite sides. Exactly. <laughs> this is my base, that's your base. Yep. But right now, MVD Yo. playing aggressive. Absolutely, man. He wants mother base for himself. Oh my god. It exploded on nothing. Yeah. Weird. up air. Good damage output from the purple Pikmin. Tries to get the up tilt. The buzz holding that shield though. Very smart. Yeah, very, very smart. <gasps> the parry! Oh wow! The up tilt. I love that. Didn't quite kill with that forward smash, but definitely put MVD on notice. We talked about it before, that metal damage yep. has the Nikita. So big. Am I, do you see that shield? The Buzz didn't take the bait though. No, he, he wanted didn't. him to run forward yes, he so did. he could pop the seat. Yes, he did. Oh my gosh. Easy forward smash. 112% right now. The Buzz in a very good position as MVD kind of blows himself up. He's got a second jump out of there. Eat the forward tilt. He's living. The Nikita is out. Yep, Been the there. skinny thing saves him. That's tilt, yep, that's gonna be a kill. Awesome stuff. Beautiful work by MVD. Exactly what he needed to force himself back into this game. The buzz stuck on the ledge, takes too long to pick an option, pays for it. Yeah, and I love the patience. He's it back, yet go center stage, and explodes, and then eight. Drops one down. <laughs> oh man, 
And the up smash just gets deleted by that Pikmin. Yeah. Good back air. Tries to hit Ooh, him with the big. Cypher. That is big. It put him in a very bad position above MVD. And he's going to pull that nade back. And that keeps happening with these Pikmin. And that is something that has been very hard for DeBuzz to deal with. It's yeah. really a paradigm shift to kind of uh, zone. Forces Back him in shield. Him. Yeah, like every you can't time. aggress on MVD because even when you see an opening, that Pikmin may ruin it for you. Yeah, absolutely. Bring you watch, back watch the, the grab. Surprise. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know he wants the grab. Oh yeah. Pikmin's out. He's got it out again. He said he's going to throw it. Hit the forward smash, but it's the weak hit. Yep. Good movement right there from the bus. Recognize that the Ooh. two forwards there. And you hit. No, not going to die yet. Yes, and he's going to toss one. Cover his options. Has to go to the reverse. No can do. The buzz. Beautiful spacing. Able to get that kill. The Buzz trying to fly away. Does not want to lose this stock. He needs that extra damage on MVD now. 15. He needs more. 15 won't win you this game. Nope. Especially against somebody as heavy as Snake. Watch oh, the bear? No, not going to kill. Not kill. Not gonna do it, Nikita. But Nikita might. So I love that. Hits it. And, oh my gosh. Just barely missed the mark. Frames off. Yep. That's it. Oh no, he's no, just no, gonna no, fourth no. throw him. Okay. Because yeah, the bomb was there. Yeah. Uh. Oh, it drops. And he knows what he's looking for. The buzz is playing he this. He knows what he's looking for. The buzz is playing this perfectly, yes, he dude. Is. Yes, he's he playing is. right around the mines. He's always just one yep. step ahead. Oh my gosh. And just like I feel like MVD gave up everything because he was he wanted the surefire down throw to up tilt. Yes. And look at how much damage he has taken because yep. of it. He was trying to force it so much, and that might be the reason he loses this set right now, 120. And remember, DeBuzz has the kill throw as well. True. You see him with the blue. He doesn't want to let it rip. He wants to see if MVD is going to come down, but he's sitting on the platform. Yeah. 143 on MVD. He has to play this just supremely to be able to win this match and the set. It's going to be very tough for him here on out. Gets the dash tech, puts DeBuzz in a bad spot. The purple Pikmin is out. Okay. Eats the second turn. hit of four to. Oh, oh my god! Gosh. If he minute. had him off stage, that might have done it. Blue Pikmin is out again. Bombs away, 73! The chase! Oh, does not get the FTL on the landing. <sighs> this is what DeBuzz has been doing all set, but oh, now he's man. kind of falling apart. He's falling apart, he does not know what to do. He's trying to play the zoning game with him. He yes, that's what he had to do. He had to! He had to! That was the only way he can win. He had to go for that bear.